So what are some ways to help in probability math homework? Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang. I've been teaching college mathematics for nine years. And probability is one of the most applicable areas of math simply because it's used in areas that students can definitely relate to, uh, whether it be card decks or figuring out the chances of you winning the lottery or even trial testimony where they want to figure out the probability that the DNA on the victim does not belong to the suspect. But there are a lot of areas in which probability can be used and there are some tips to help folks with probability math homework. One thing you definitely want to stay on top of is definitions. Probability has many, many definitions, whether it be counting definitions, permutations, combinations, mutually exclusive events, independent events, etc. There are a lot of definitions there and the more quickly you can master the definitions, the sooner you'll be able to help in that regard. Now, probability theory has a lot of formulas involved. There's a lot of little ratios, a lot of odds, a lot of probability card deck formulas, and you also need to figure out the structures of whether uh, card, cards, dice, even coins, and the many different kinds of scenarios that you can have when it comes to probability. So definitely master those. Not only are you supposed to figure out the probability of something happening, you also need to figure out the probability of events not happening. So the positive probability and the negative event probabilities are very important in this field. And lastly, think about how probability is involved in statistics. Statistics often involve a lot of probability theory. And so you take the lot of the probability ideas and are able to use them in number crunching scenarios. There's a field called empirical statistics which involve the number crunching that we're talking about. So my name is Jimmy Chang and that is how you help with probability math homework.